Chinese soldiers entered Uttarakhand's Parahodi last week, Home Ministry officials. New Delhi, some 50 Chinese soldiers entered into Uttarakhand's Parahodi last week and spent about two hours before going back, Home Ministry sources said on Monday. The incident took place on July 25, Tuesday, around 9 a.m. The Chinese entered one kilometer into Indian territory and allegedly ordered cattle herders to leave with their animals. Last year, there was a similar transgression by fewer Chinese soldiers, also in July. Officials say there have been many such transgressions as both sides have different perceptions of the line of actual control. This year, however, it has taken place at a time India and China are locked in a massive standoff at the border in Sikkim, the longest between the two countries since the 1962 war. China says Indian troops crossed the border at Sikkim in June to stop the Chinese army from constructing a road on a remote Himalayan plateau it calls Donglang. Bhutan says the region is Doklam, and is part of its kingdom. India, a close ally of Bhutan, deployed troops to stop the road project, prompting Beijing to accuse India of trespassing on Chinese soil. Two days after Chinese soldiers entered Barahodi, India's national security adviser Ajit Doval traveled to Beijing and met with the Chinese leadership including President Xi Jinping. Mr. Doval highlighted major problems in ties during his meetings. Mr. Doval's meeting with President Jinping has not resulted in the defusing of tension. India says China has violated a 2012 understanding that trijunction boundary points between India, China, and third countries will be finalized in consultation with the countries concerned. On June 30, India told China that its attempt to construct a road in the Doklam area would cause a significant change of status quo and lead to serious security implications.